afternoon, how are you? How is everyone doing tonight? How are you all today? Today, um, welcome to my channel. Coming to you live from Maryland. I hope you guys are doing great. Um, before we get started, if you have not, make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you're subscribed. Um, of course, share, subscribe to my channel. So what I wanted to take a moment to talk about today is picking and finding your niche, right? Um, we talked about a lot of things that y'all can do, all that good stuff. But I've come on today to share with you um, the benefits of having or picking out a niche. Um, in this industry, we tend to offer a lot of services, right? We tend to put everything together you would see some people's business solely rely on just doing DNA services I'm gonna talk about that in my next video make sure you're subscribed and you're in the know so when all of these videos begin to drop you will be the first to know all right so again take a minute and subscribe to my channel so like I said um, we have businesses that solely rely on doing or offering DNA services. While some, what they just do is fingerprint services. While some, all they do is consortium. Some, what they do is just um, drug testing. Some, what they do is simply um, drawing blood, right? But um, we've come to tell you guys that, hey, come. Can put all of this together and it's doable it's feasible in my ministry in my industry what we do is put all of the services and we offer them but trend right i want to come on today to tell you that um picking your niche is very important you have to make sure you stay on top of your game and you prioritize what works for you as individuals we all have our strength right and we all have our weaknesses it's the same thing for our businesses. Our businesses, you should be able to identify your business strength. What services brings in the most revenue? That is the that is gonna that's considered the strength of your business. What is performing the most? All right, you do you're gonna run a performance check on your business and you would see what brings in the most revenue. That means you would determine that this particular services has the best is the best out of them right so you have been able to identify the strength of your business what i'm saying is that as individuals we all have strength it's the same principle for businesses our businesses have strength but i have come on today to share with you on how to determine and pick strength or find a niche in your business the reason is because in this industry there are so many um what you do for a is different from what you do for b pay close detailed attention to what i'm saying let me recap let me say this again what i'm saying to you is that it is not possible for you to use the same marketing strategy for all of your services all right you cannot use your marketing strategy for DNA. It's not the same strategy that you're going to adopt for fingerprint. It's not the same strategy that you're going to adopt for clear. It's not the same strategy that you're going to adopt for blood draw. It's not the same marketing principles and strategies that you're going to adopt for drug test. That is what I'm saying. So to help you understand this industry, I am saying to you that I want you to know that your business have strength and make sure that you understand that strength and pick a niche from there all right in my business i have a niche my business has a strength the reason is because our businesses have, we are settled we are situated in different areas right some of us we might be saturated with a lot of um, nursing homes and assisted living in that situation your best bet might be your first strength might be just the um, blood drop. Some of us, it's just, it varies, all right? So what I'm saying again is that I want you to pick a niche and find strength in your business because 
you cannot use the same medicine to cure when you have bacteria you're gonna use what antibiotics right you cannot use antibiotics to cure virus it's different all right so that's the same thing know what works best for your businesses I don't want you to because you will begin to if you if you fail and not understand that your business has a strength and that you cannot use the same marketing strategies for your business because all the audiences right the audience for DNA are not the same audience but are not the same clients for your drug testing they are not the same audience for your flu bottle all right we tend to work closely with um, doctors, assistant living, nursing homes. All those populations are the ones that need blood draw. Okay? And feel from the rest of the population. It's the same thing for DNL, for drug test. Pre-employment, you know that you're not going to market to anyone else but employers, but consortiums, right? TPA, C slash TPA. Those are the people that are looking for drug testing. You're gonna go to nursing home, you're gonna figure out and market, uh, you're gonna go to staffing agencies, every employer, right? They are the ones that tends to use drug testing. Post accident, owner operator, transportation industry. You cannot use that same strategy that you're using for blood draw to market to those individuals. That is the reason why I say, I don't want you to put your business scattered. I want you to streamline and find strength in your business and market your services to the right audience. Okay? Because we tend to put it all together and unfortunately, we don't see that revenue or that progress because we feel like, I want to do this, I want to do this, I want to do this. By the time we start to put everything without structure, without plan, without strategies, it gets all messed up every day we say put this put this but then you might be in los angeles and there is no need for dna there is need for dna all over what i'm saying in your area you might be doing well one of your services it might be blood drug that might be doing so well for you because of your area so as a business owner start to find your strength start to find strength in your business services the services that you offer and use that as a leverage okay that's what I've come on to let you know. Let me break it down some for you. When we market DNA, there is a way that we market that business. People that looks for business, people that look for DNA services, they don't go anywhere else but one particular place. Right? So when they go to that place, which is the search engine, that's how they use, that's how you that's how you're gonna market that service. You are not going to think a nursing home will typically start to look for you on the search engine. It's different, that's what I'm saying. So I hope I've not confused you enough, but help you gather um, this information and use it to your advantage, okay? I want you to know that your services vary. So prioritize your first three. It could be drug test, blood draw, DNA. Make sure you prioritize and find strength in all of the services and know your target and your right audience. All right. My next video is going to be on how you can start your own DNA services or your own DNA business. Solely what you're going to be offering is DNA services. Even in DNA, we can strategically just pick a niche. There are so many types of DNA services. Yours might just be doing paternity and relationship testing. All right. We're going to talk about that. Make sure, again, you're subscribed so that you can be in the know when all in this beautiful videos begin to drop. I hope I've been able to bless you if you're looking for further assistance and on experience in starting and launching your own program, your business. All right. Make sure you head to my website, officialcoacheli.com. Go through the course session. Go on this course tab. Scroll down some. You're going to find all of the trainings and courses that I offer. All right, specifically the mentorship program is designed to help you. It's a five weeks mentorship program. At the end of the fifth week, 
you will be launching your business it is guaranteed we've done it before and we will do it again so if you're looking for experiences and some help targeted towards your needs um let me know a very good number to reach me you can text or call me it's 301-883-1047 all right it's gonna be on your screen as well um i'll talk to you again make sure you like and subscribe to this channel um talk to you now bye for now coach e bye